Hi, Libra. This is Kathy. Welcome to my channel, Kathy Mamelin, Psychic Medium. Welcome to a timeless love reading. This is for my singles. This is for new love coming into your life or a confirmation of a love that's relatively new that's come into your life. We're going to ask spirit for what is this energy? What will this connection be like? Any clues or any evidence that spirit may have for you or anything spirit wants to share with you at this time. So welcome to my Libra, sun, moon, rising and Venus and any cross watchers, obviously always welcome. So grateful spirit guided you here today. New love for my singles. What do you have for us, Spirit? What is going on around us? What do you need us to hear? I am listening for you now. I have forgiveness. I acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love. So forgiving yourself, forgiving others, that's constant, you know, just that letting go, opening up your heart to receive. I have friendship. I understand that a friend in my is in my life for a reason. People are being put on your path. They could be put on your path as stepping stones to meet the person that you're supposed to meet or to help guide you through a phase or a period of time in your life right now. I've got pride. I love myself and I see myself in everyone. You do love yourself. Your spirits are high. Your hope is high. Your integrity is high, spirit just said. So just keep that elevation and that... Um, vibration very high. I have doubt. I release the need to know all the answers. You don't have to have all the answers. You're learning. We're all learning. We're all here to learn. We're just constantly moving forward is the most important thing. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome to anybody that's new. So grateful Spirit has guided you here. Please remember to hit that like and subscribe button. Comment below. Claim this reading. This reading is for you. Spirit, share with me new love Share with me what's coming towards us. What is it that you need us to know today? Let's say new love. I have a ten of swords. I see the truth. I see the truth in an ending. For every ending, there's a new beginning. I have a page of wands. I am always open to good news. I'm always open. I'm open to receive good news with this page. I have a four of wands. The universe brings all I need to feel blissful. So there's the four of wands. There's the commitment. I feel like that's coming. And I have an ace of wands. I am inspired to follow my passion. So this feeling of what it is that you want, I want to build a life around somebody. I want to have a home. For those of you that want to be married, you'd love to meet somebody that you could settle down and have a lifetime commitment with. It's this feeling of the passion is coming. The passion's on its way. Look at this beautiful, vibrant energy, even just in the color of these cards. I just feel like I'm, I'm filled with light. I'm filled with energy and I'm filled with hope. Also, there's this beautiful sense of hope, um, hope and wonder, you know, like is yours, um, you know, like where is, where is this going? Where are we headed? Um, this fulfillment is, is coming into me. Also a sense of fulfilling energy, um, I listen to my heart and I follow my own knowing with the four cups. You know what's best for you. You know when somebody is going to be good for you and they're not. I have all, all I have all I wish for in my relationships. That fulfillment they had just said a moment ago is certainly our ten of cups. Ten of cups is I have arrived. I have everything that I need. So there, there is a sense of fulfillment, and there's something that. Um, you've been waiting for, you know, with this connection. And I have a death card. I let go and I embrace this new beginning. I'm excited. So if you have come in out of something, you're transitioning from one relationship into the next. Um, obviously, bottom of the deck, I'll thank you now, Spirit, for my lover's card. Thank you. Is this ready to put that deck down? I always check it. I trust my knowing and make a commitment. So where's my where's my four wands? You know, this this energy of um, I, I know what I want. I'm going to say it that way, that spirit knows what you want. They want to bring you the person that you want to share your life with. They want to put this person in your arms. You know, it, it's just a feeling of holding you. Um, you know, I want to hold you, you know, I, um, I, I want to hold you now in my arms, hold you in my arms. And I feel like, 
that's something so simple, but we've been waiting, you know, what I, I want to just say a hug, you know, like just hold me, you know, we can lie here and I can lay on, lay on you and, and lay on your arms, you know, at night. And, um, and you just hold me in your arms is, is really just such a simple um, energy, but um, a lot of us are manifesting that. So whoever this is, they just want to hold you. It's like, they're searching for you. Let's see what else they're saying. A plane, a journey is indicated either physically or metamorphically. Your life is about to become more full. You're ready for this journey. This journey's ready to take off. So timeline, I'm gonna, I do have some timeline cards I'll get to in a moment, but um, it's a key to the new beginning, new directions, adventures away, letting go of the past. So you're going to have the key to their heart. You're going to open. This is a new door opening. This is a new key, new door, um, you know, just all of those things. And so it's a new person. I'm going to say it that way, too. It's a new person. This is not the past coming back. This is, you know, I've ended something and I'm moving on and I've been hoping for somebody I can share my life with. And an eagle, you will soar towards your destiny with greater clarity. You're a better person is how it's coming into me. The, the trials and tribulations that you've gone through, the, the challenges, the obstacles, um, they've made you stronger. You're not going to pick the same person that you picked from your past. You're, you're wiser. You're smarter. You've been there, done that energy. And you're just not going to go there anymore. So let's talk about the person who wants to hold you in their arms. Spirit, can I start to get some clues? I'm just going to grab some letters. You love their scent. It could be the first thing that you notice about them. They smell amazing. I feel like they look amazing and they smell amazing. Uh, you love their hair. It could be the color of their hair. You love the letter M. I have a W today. I have they're very independent. Good. We want independent. We want strong. They could have a tattoo. Uh, I love their mouth. I love their smile. I love their their teeth. Teeth are important. <laughs> they have a beautiful smile. Maybe they have a big, beautiful smile, and you just can't help but looking at, at their smile. That's nice. Very affectionate. I just want to hold you. Absolutely. The letter T. They're tall. I have their trustworthy. Beautiful, beautiful energy. The letter E. I have fashionable, so they look good, smell good, and I have the letter C. So we got a handful of clues. One more spirit said the letter B that could have um, that could have some meaning to somebody. And you love the sound of their voice. So they look good, they smell good, and they sound good. And their eyes, you love their eyes. So obviously we're very attracted to this person. I, I feel like there's so many things that I love about them, whether it's the color of their eyes or their smile or their, um, you know, I'm, I'm attracted to them. So, you know, they're a hottie, you know, like, I'm going to say this hottie, this hottie is into you. How about that? You know, um, I think that that's kind of a fun energy, you know, that they're, they want to hold you in their arms, but they're as into you as you are to them. So let's see what else they're saying. I've got, I want you more than ever. Okay. I want you more than ever. I want you to tell me your dreams so I can share them with you so we can start to plan. We can talk about them. I love that. Um, I can't be with you right now. Maybe there's something preventing us from being together full time or sharing a home together or doesn't mean it's forever. It might mean just you know, we could have children that are still a certain age and we're not ready to uh, give up the households because of school or circumstances. But um, it doesn't mean that they're not going to be with you forever. It could be that there's a delay from the time that we are together till the time that we start to, you know, have a more per permanent life together. Now is the time to meet this person. I won't give up on this connection. Somebody who wants to be all in. I like that. Love has no boundaries, like this feeling of I want to make it work. I want to make it work. I want to make us work. Letters of love. So they could be really good at sending text messages, emails saying, 
you know, I'm thinking about you, kind of this constant communication or this consistent communication. I know that you are my soulmate. That's beautiful. So a soulmate energy. And how about I manifested you? I love that. I, I love this feeling of um, I know you're my soulmate and I've been manifesting you. I think that's gorgeous. You know, just um, not only are you out there manifesting your person, but there's somebody out there manifesting you and that they may find you first. So that's how it's coming into me. So we've got this beautiful kind of hot energy that's totally into you and they can't wait to hold you. And it's a new door. It's a new door. Let's get a couple of these heart messages. I always like these. They're just, they're hard to shuffle. So I'm just going to go in here and grab one. How's that? Let's do this. Um, forgiveness. Stop focusing your energy on past events for life is too precious to waste you create your reality by what you think, dream, and imagine. So what is it that you want, right? Don't No regrets. No regrets for the past. We only want to think about the future. Let's get another one of these. There you are. And I have weight. Don't rush into it. Allow nature to take its course. Allow the divine to work. Allow divine timing to work. Something along those lines. And one more. Look at that light coming in, shining on you. And I have a message for you. I'm thinking of you this very moment. Your love fills me with light and I love you. So almost like your future person, you know, your future person has a message for you and they love you and they're just looking for you now and they're just waiting to find you. So I'm thinking of you, I'm manifesting you. So I, I love the idea the other side is working to find you, um, that it's not all on your shoulders. Spirit, when? When will this wait be over? When is the timing or any timing around this connection that you can share with me today? What is it that you need me to hear for my Libra? Let's say I have February. Okay, we could be it could be a birthday month. I have this month. My compass is is steering my your you to me. I love I love compasses. I always like this feeling of like the compass is going to help me find you. I have August. Look for butterflies, butterfly tattoo. Even I have this week, this month. All right, so the timeline could be short, and I have July being important. So I have. I have a lot of energy you can see here in the summertime, July, August, but I also love the energy of almost any time this week, this month, um, in spirit saying bottom of the deck sooner than you expected. So we've got this new love coming in sooner than we expect. I think that's beautiful. Let's put this out into the universe. I want to thank Spirit for these messages today. If you're new to my channel, please remember to hit that like and subscribe button. I want to thank uh, you all for joining me. If anyone would like to book a private reading with me, please check out my website link below, kathymamelinpsychicmedium.com.